the um as far as you know when it gets a flat hand by the head or whatever i don't know if i could even shoot this with just a button i don't i don't even i don't think i could shoot it with just a button so it is what it is but maybe i could i don't know hey guys it's lj make sure you like the video and subscribe for more great contents for my daddy good afternoon not that 2k lab man check this out man i know i, I know why y'all here man you're here because your jump shot is broken and you need another jump shot and i oblige y'all every time man because y'all know i got the best jump shots man the best like look man this is the best button jump shot if you want to use the shot stick it's, it's real easy on the shot stick probably better if you're using the shot stick man you probably won't miss with this one man so look we got all that for you right here and we're gonna uh we're gonna knock it down for you in one second man but before we get started make sure y'all like the video and comment y'all thoughts down below because y'all already know we're trying to go with this thing to the moon, Alice! hey man nobody told y'all this today y'all my brothers my sisters my family love y'all dearly man y'all y'all the real the real mvps y'all did come through on the uh on the video earlier today with the 500 views so somebody gonna be getting 50 dollars in cash app or somebody gonna be getting a copy of 2k man it, it just is what it is y'all gonna y'all gonna be able to choose uh which one y'all want man so we'll see how that goes man i probably hey look this jumper right here is one that I made. And like I said, it's a variation of one that I made, but I feel like, I feel like I perfected it, man, because what was happening was on my own, the shot, the flick of the wrist was not fast enough. So as a result, I kept missing, I kept missing the shot when I was using my stick shooting or whatever. And y'all know I'm a big proponent of the stick shooting, but you don't have to use the stick to shoot this one. This is a really, uh, really easy tail. Once he, once it gets back there, that's all you want to do just let it ride just let it fly and uh i wanted something where like let's say i could potentially shoot limitless range shots like like i because see right there's gonna tell you it's slow and so so on limitless range i need to be a little bit faster so that's that's gonna say excellent but i think you just can't unless you're cheating to some bro i think you just can't hit shots that are outside your range but unless you unless you know you got it going you got the game going or whatever and it's just like this bucket um unless you just really got it going or whatever man so that's good that's not good so like i'm outside my range right now and it's it's tough but when you're inside your range obviously it's chicken man so that's what i'm working on right now trying to see if i could learn how to consistently hit shots that are at the edge of my range but uh this one like i said it's it's a really easy tail as far as that part like like the um as far as you know when it gets a flat hand by the head or whatever i don't know if i could even shoot this with just a button i don't i don't even i don't think i could shoot it with just a button so it is what it is but maybe i could i don't know okay it looks like i can man so it looks like this one is one of those that i, that I can limit this range my, my my goal honestly is to get off the is to get off the shot stick i want to just use the button man because using the shot stick is like it's like now it's fashionable fashionable right like like nobody was using it at first. Now everybody's using the shot stick. It just feels like it's, it's no point now. So I want to go back to the button. You know what I'm saying? Like 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 uh like Nelly said, uh, when y'all y'all had braids, and you know I had a fade. Now y'all switching to fades. Now I'm thinking about braids. But you know I'm fresh from the barbershop with a uh with dreads. So you know it is what it is, man. So that's what we that's what we gonna go with, man. Look. It's been long enough. Let me show y'all the jump shot, and I'm gonna give y'all some tips as far as how to shoot with the, with the shot stick and all that. And then we gonna go from there, man. So this is the jump shot right here. Make sure y'all hit the like button because I didn't, I ain't, I ain't uh, stall y'all out on this one, man. This is it right here. Um, Contavious, uh, N Nikia Alexander Walker is the base. Contavious Caldwell Pope, 65%, and uh, Terrence Ross, 35%. I think to get contavious caldwell pope as a as a as a release though you gotta have uh something man let me see release speed caldwell pope to get this you have to you gotta have a you gotta have uh either a mid-range or a three ball of 85 so that's that's gonna limit a lot of people man now this blend is dope you can blend it a little bit more the more you go this way the more defensive immunity you're gonna get. So you can probably go until you get, you know, a, a, 
almost a maxed out A plus and, and you know, some more defensive immunity. And then Terrence Ross is gonna let you be able to, um, Terrence Ross is gonna be able to let you shoot it a little bit better, man. Like, I just like Terrence Ross because with Terrence Ross, you can, um, and I'm, I'm gonna change it there. With Terrence Ross, it, it, it's like it's like an over the head joint where where you can really see the shot. So that's why I like that, man. But look, like you can get it up to an A plus with more defensive immunity and all of that. You're gonna you, you won't jump as high. But for me, I'm I'm one of them people, man. I don't have to jump as high. So for me, it's all good. I don't need to jump high. Um, I just like to get the shot off. I like looking at the same spot on my screen because I try to watch it the whole way through the jump shot. And uh, you know, and I got it on set point, and you can you can tinker tailor uh soldier spot it any way that you want to. But I got it on, I've got it on uh I don't know how many I got it on, but let's let's find out. All right, that's a good shot right there. And like I said, it doesn't it's not much different visually, but that definitely changed the stats. And um, like I said, for that one I knew I was off. But uh it definitely changes the stats, man, and you can just get it off much faster. Like, like I just think it's a, it's a it's a good shot because I can see it very clearly, and I don't know why they're saying it's early right there because that's cash. Pipe it up. I got them pipes on reserves active. So, like I said, man, it, this is one I've been using it today. Been shooting well in the proving grounds, and it's just it just looks like it's just it's just buttery smooth, silky like butter, man. Now 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 uh, in the last thing, let me give y'all one of these right here, bro, so we can. We can uh, tell you how many ticks it is over, over or whatever. It is, the Q is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So if you if you put it there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And it's pretty much a maxed out A plus. Now, you can go a little bit further. I got it at 15 now and uh, 15 or 16. And like I said, you have to kind of tailor it to where you want to look at it. Cause see, I got it over there. I see, I moved it there. You see how I'm early every time now? I mean, I was early on that one and it could have just been because that was the first one, but I wanted, what I wanted to do is have it a little bit, a uh, little bit more of the flat hand. Cause that's when I want to let it go on the flat hand. That, that's, that's my, um, that's my goal when the hand is flat, but I want, when the hand is flat, I want to have a little extra piece of a second to uh to do it so that's that's what i want i think i'm a little later on that right there so we'll go with that so that was the, i was just i was just off on the timing so like i said right right here it's at 15 joints and i think i'm a little bit more comfortable with it there because when it's uh you know you're not i don't want it to when you see yourself when you see i might i mean i might i might need to go two ticks to the left and it'll be perfect but uh like i said you gotta tinker with that thing pause to make sure that the shots are like you want it to be because uh you got to make sure you got to make sure the shot is exactly where you want it to be and i don't i don't want to miss early i'd rather miss late than early so what i'm going to do is i'm going to uh see early early again so i'm gonna put it two ticks back to the left and then i think that'll be exactly where i want it to be visually but like i said you have to tinker with these man and just make sure because in competition you know the windows are a lot tighter and so this is just something that you're gonna have to do for you, right? With the visual cue and all of that. This is something you're gonna have to do for yourself and just decide, okay, where, there we go. That, that's good, you're gonna always miss the first one, so. But uh, you have to decide for yourself exactly where you want that visual cue to be. I want it to be when the hand is flat and I can just let it go there, so. And like I said, I will just keep, I will keep messing with this until, uh, until I like it, but I use two two methods of shooting. I use the shot stick and I use the button. So I want to make sure that I don't see any of any of the swirl, any of the uh fishbowl swirling on either the on unless I know I missed it, right? Like right there, I might have been a little bit fast, but um I want to make sure that I don't see any of that fishbowl and when I'm knowing I'm hitting my cue. When I don't, when I know I didn't hit the cue. Like right there, I know I didn't hit it, so I'm cool with it. But when I when I feel like I'm hitting it, I want to see just straight swishes. So I might have to go one more tick or whatever, but hey, it is what it is. Shots going in, shots going up, shots going down. 
anyway man and plus in competition it's gonna be a lot faster than this anyway so you know i, I think i'm gonna leave it where it is but y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section man hopefully this joint works for y'all uh like i said i'm gonna keep dropping these jump shots even though people are not really rocking with them man but can we get the 300 likes on this video man a lot of people gonna watch it let's see if we can get it out there and get this thing going to the moon holla y'all next time love each and every last one of y'all we're gonna be streaming in a little bit so make sure y'all stay tuned for that and i'll holla y'all next time till next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ Guys, please. Guys, please.